Hey everyone, Ashley here with RSS Podcasting. Today I'm walking you through how to add chapters to your podcast from your RSS dashboard. Chapters are a great way to share highlights with your audience about where in the show the biggest moments are happening. Here's how to do it. First, log into your RSS Podcasting account. In your My Podcast dashboard, you should see your scheduled and published podcast episodes. If you don't have any episodes yet, you'll need to load one to either be scheduled or published to move on to the next step. Choose the episode you want to add chapters to and click the three dots on the right-hand side of the screen to open the episode menu. Then click Chapters. Now, listen to your audio and determine where you want to add a chapter to your show. Choose the start time and finish time for the chapter and add it to the respective from and to time slots. Then, if you choose to do so, add some chapter art to the chapter to give your audience a visual cue to what is being discussed in that chapter. Otherwise, the next step is to add your chapter title and click Save. For the purposes of this tutorial, we chose an audio snippet that introduced the listener to the six pieces of equipment needed to start a podcast, and we upload an image of someone podcasting. Finally, we titled our chapter, Six Pieces of Equipment to Podcast. From here, you can either click Add Chapter to add another one, or if you're finished, just click Done. Now when a listener visits your podcast public page on rss.com for that episode, your chapter will be visible, and your listener can jump ahead to the point in the audio that matches up with the title of your chapter to listen in to that specific subject. You can add as many chapters as you feel relevant to your individual episodes. Not only will this act as show notes, but they will act as a guide for your audience so they can hone in on the main points they want to hear. Thanks for tuning in.